Hey guys, it's Nick. I'm in Istanbul, Turkey at the famous Taksim Square. And so I'm going to walk down Istiklal Street and see what it's like on a Friday afternoon. It is usually packed day and night. So let's see what's going on on Istiklal Street, the famous walking street. So this is, I guess this is kind of like the Times Square of Istanbul. Everything is going on over here. So this is a big shopping street as well as just socializing and walking and people watching as well as a lot of hotels around here including small hotels off the side streets and a whole lot of bars and clubs and nightlife. Uh, I know that well because my hotel is right around the corner from all this nightlife and I hear it going till like four in the morning or whatever. Good thing I'm a heavy sleeper. Here comes the tram that goes up and down Istakol. It's a old school tram so some people I guess take it uh, for the Instagrammable photos and all of that. It's a throwback to old times. So, I feel like I should take a ride up that thing. Pretty cool. But Istakal goes for a pretty long way. So, um, if you need to get down Istakal, you might want to take that thing or more importantly, if you're coming from the other end of Istigal, it's kind of uphill from here. So the tram may be helpful so you don't have to walk all that way uphill. But there's some really famous places. I, this place looks like it got some really specialized kind of pastries and whatnot. Alright, what is that? So you got all the main stores over here, but like I said, on these side streets is where everything is going on at night. And there's a few different clusters of where the bars are, as well as some like clubs on the avenue and stuff like that. So if you come down here, just walk around and I guess follow the music and you'll find a lot of these places. I'm also probably going to do a night tour of the nightlife around here on the side streets as well to help people figure out where everything is. Got your Nike and McDonald's and all of that. All right down these streets there's a lot of bars and whatnot and up these streets as well. Come at night, definitely uh, walk around these side streets and you'll find all kinds of stuff. And this area is, or most of Istanbul, at least from what I've seen, is very safe. So even late at night, 11, 12 o'clock at night, number one, this place is packed. And, you know, there's police all over the place, but there's also families, you know, husband, wife, and little kids are with their strollers walking up and down the avenue and everything. Uh, that's how safe everybody perceives it and I guess how it is. Uh, so it's totally okay for anybody, any time of day or night to be out here. You won't have any problems. So 
I don't know if you can see that, but I mean, it goes downhill and it's packed with people as far as you can see. And if you keep going down, uh, the Galata Tower is down that way as well. So these streets as well, there's a Yuri Gagarin bar, there's a, a up this way, there's a Madame Tussauds over here next to Sephora, and my hotel is like two blocks behind it, and so that area has a whole bunch of bars and karaoke bars and kind of like Arab bars and Irish bar and like all kinds of stuff. So. <laughs> It is really lively. Um, I'm, I'm imagining what it's going to be like tonight on Friday. But uh, yeah, so down here and the next streets over, the next like two streets to the right. You just go down there, there's a lot of stuff going on as well. And as always, if you want to eat something, the stuff on the avenue is a lot more expensive than the stuff just half a block or a block away down the side streets. So uh, keep that in mind. If money is a little bit of an issue or whatever, you just don't want to spend a lot for the same thing. Just go down one of these side streets and you'll see plenty of places that are packed with people uh, eating there so you know it's good and uh, you can't go wrong really. So down this street and the next street, uh, a lot of bars and clubs and stuff. So this is down the street of Bambi. Yeah, so right down there, Of course, there's all kinds of clothes shopping and jewelry and bags and makeup and designer stuff as well. Uh, exchange rates, 33.6 to sell US dollars and get Turkish Lira. So that's about 1% under the international rate of about 33.9, which is not bad. Uh, if you walk down a bit, you might get like 33.7. I think the best I saw any place was maybe 33.9, something like that. That's where I exchanged money before. That's 33.7. Get in it. see this there's more to go and I guess that's where the tram ends over there so that is a pretty long walk that you could avoid if you take the tram and it's probably similar to 
what the metro and uh, uh, the, the modern tram cost, the T1, which is like 20 Turkish lira, which is like 60, 60 something cents. So guys, that's a look at what's going on on Istikal Street in Istanbul, Turkey on a Friday summer afternoon. Like I said, this place is always busy night and day, so if you come to Istanbul, you definitely have to come through here, either just through the daytime, either just for the daytime for shopping and people watching, or at night to the bars and clubs and stuff like that. And if you get a chance, you probably want to take a ride on that little old tram. It looks pretty cool. I think we're going to try it. Hope you like this one, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.